Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Brie and we are here in the finale of Discovering University with June. So it is Wednesday morning of June's last semester. He only has three days left in his class. He does have class at 9.30 this morning and he needs to give his presentation. So he's going to do that. He's going to go ahead and give us when it turns like when it turns eight, he's going to go ahead and give his presentation for the privilege of painting because that's one of his classes and he also after he goes to his classes today we'll have him finish writing his essay um but unfortunately i i did play through a lot of last time he was only in the beginning of his third semester but now he is a senior and so i played a lot with him in the recent couple of days and so unfortunate for him i've been trying to get him better so i did complete my goal. I said last time I want to complete at least one level of aspiration and we did that. So now he is um, a devilish dueler and he, we need to reach level three of the spellcaster rank to become adepts. Right now he's just an acolyte and he needs to win three duels against other spellcasters. But unfortunately he hasn't won any duels between any spellcasters and he was so bad he was so bad that the fact that he what is this practice oh that's a mirror i was like what is that it, he was so bad at it that he actually got cursed twice so he got the curse of awkward embraces you're really just into hugging and touching others now it's hard to resist awkward and he got the curse of unwarranted hostility for some reason everyone just wants to be mean to you and even start to fight with you so Yes, unfortunately, he has been getting in a lot of fights with just everybody and their brother. As you can see, I'll show you his relationship panel right now. He has so many bad relationships with people. He has a bad relationship with Belle. He has a bad relationship with Juan. He has a bad relationship with George and Raven. He just has so many bad relationships with everybody because they keep just wanting to fight him. Poor guy, like literally like eight, ten people like literally have a vendetta against poor June. And they just want to fight him. So... Yeah, right now he's presenting his thing, but then he'll go off to his next class and he'll finish his classes and then we will catch back up with him when he is working on his um, paper for his class. It belongs in a museum or does it? Okay, so we are here at Larry's Lagoon and June, we're going to have him work on his university coursework, term paper. He's going to edit it. So he's pretty much almost done with writing his paper. Um... He just needs to edit it and make sure it's okay. Oh goodness, there's Gabrielle Colbert. Yeah, so June got in a fight with her, obviously. They have a very bad relationship. Their meter is like super bad. Okay, what's going on? Who's this guy? Oh, Landon Reed. Okay, okay, this dude doesn't hate you, so um, don't start a fight with him, Landon. I mean, not Landon. Your name's not Landon. Don't start a fight with him, June. Okay, just do your cor coursework. Don't play Blake Block. Okay, we're gonna do your term paper. You need to edit your term paper, man. Edit, sit down here and edit that term paper. We also got um, June, okay, good. Okay, it's looking great. Okay, so you can actually turn it in. Okay, I thought that you still needed to work on it. So we're gonna actually have him turn it in. Uh, university coursework, term paper, submit it. Let's see, what homework does he have to do? He has to do his homework for the privilege of painting and it belongs in museum or does it? Okay, so, is his name Landon? Oh, London, London. Don't get in a fight with London Red, okay? Just don't do it, June. Um, but we'll have him do his homework for the privilege of painting, because that class is tomorrow. We got him a familiar, because once you reach the next rank, you get a familiar. So he has a familiar, and I was thinking, maybe that guy will help him with his like the, his like um, all of his duels. But no, not so far. And he does not help from June getting beat up by everybody because everybody's still mad at him and wants to beat him up. So yeah, we're going to let June do his homework and then we're going to take him back to the magic realm because I think he needs to do some actual training with some of the sages. Okay, so we are here in the magic realm and now June needs to find a teacher. Oh look, this is one of his teachers. Let's talk to him and ask him to teach us. We need to ask for magical training. Magical training. Because, you know, like our butt's been getting kicked by so many people. 
You know, we just been really like, hey man, um, you know, recently I've just been like doing really bad. I'm sure he's saying that's like I really need your help because I really suck at my my job right now. <laughs> so please help me. So yes, he's gonna get his magical training from him and learn lots. So then hopefully he can be better and not lose fights and get rid of these curses. I have no idea how to get rid of these curses. Um, I would love to get rid of both of them. But who knows how to get rid of, rid of them. <laughs> but at this moment, everybody hates June, really. Okay, so June did learn Delicioso from the spell, so that's good. Um, but now he needs to work on... He only has one class. It belongs in a museum or doesn't. He needs to do the homework for that class. And then... So I'm glad that his magical training is going pretty well. Um, but... He needs to keep getting there to become adepts. So, yes. We'll keep having him work on magic versus homework and stuff like that. Ooh, let's just, you know, maybe maybe after his magical training, we can, like, talk to somebody and, you know, try and duel against them. Because poor June, we really need to get his confidence back up, confidence back up in dueling. Because he just is having such bad luck. Also, this dude's hair is very nice. I've never seen this hair before. Okay, so they're having a good relationship so far. That's good. Um, so let's ask him just to like... Let's just do like a friendly duel. We don't even need to do anything serious. We just want to do a friendly duel with Daryl, okay? We just want to see how this goes. I really hope June does well. Actually, I have no idea really what the familiars do. Maybe they like do something for you. Oh, just miss familiar or rename them. Um, so you really only have two options, but hopefully June can do better. So come on, June. We believe in you. You got this. You got this. You got this, June. Okay. It's starting off pretty good. Okay. You got this, June. Ooh, okay, okay. That wasn't good for... June, but that's okay. It happens. Ooh. They're kind of, like, evenly matched. I like the dude's wand, too. It's a very nice wand. Come on, June. You got this. It's like, it's like you're, it's like a boxing match, and you're just cheering for your side, like, June, go, June. Go, go, go. <laughs> We're, like, really cheering for June. Oh, the bird's like, oh, ooh, oh, crap. <laughs> oh. Come on, June. Oh, 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 okay, June lost, okay. Okay, um, <laughs> okay, well, June lost, but, you know, that's okay, that's okay. Ask him for magical training. Let's see if we can ask this dude for magical training, because who knows what level this guy is. Maybe he is a much higher level than us. Probably, would seem so, why we were losing. Can you get some magical training from him? Also, his style is, like, super nice. Like, he's dressed, like, super cool. He's like, yeah, look at me. I'm a cool dude. Oh, yeah, the guy's giving him training. That's good. Okay. He's like, yeah, you just beat me, so please train me now. Please train me in your ways. All right, so we will get back from his training and um, go ahead and fast forward to tomorrow. Okay, it is Thursday morning. June needs to eat and finish up his homework for this one class. I gotta figure out which one it is. I think it's that one that we just clicked. Yes, it belongs in the museum. He needs to finish up his homework. He literally has 75% left. And then he will be off to class. And he has two back-to-back -back classes. So after he does those two back-to-back -back classes, we're gonna go and actually like go on a date with Ren again. Because we haven't done that in a while. And he needs to go on a date. And he's pretty much only has one class to do his homework for, too. So I'll see you when we're ready to go on the date. Um, ask her on a date. Can they not go on a date? Ask on date. Come on. Come on. Poor guy. He's tense, but she's also uncomfortable. So this is great. Oh, she denied him. Okay, okay. Um, okay. Well, that's awkward. We were going to try and have them go on a date. But maybe it's just because, like, 
they were both kind of like I don't know maybe they need to vent and you know he just needs to have a vent session and I'll watch Otter Things premiere we'll watch the premiere of the TV to give him some fun let's see if she likes that he's like you know everybody's hating me lately and you know I've been in a lot of stress because I've been losing a lot of duels and nobody likes me and they just keep fighting with me she's like um okay she's like oh okay 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 um yeah so that didn't work out like we planned it um so that didn't work out like we planned it so that kind of sucks but you know sometimes you just aren't maybe after he gets a little bit of fun they can go on a date so let's try and see if that will work Okay, okay, so June is in a little bit of a better mood. Let's try and ask Ren on a date again, and we'll see if that works. Okay, I keep missing ask on date. Come on, let's ask Ren on a date again and see if she likes it. So he's feeling more confident now. She's still embarrassed, but hopefully because he is happier than her, she will say yes, and we can actually go on a date with him. Yes, it worked. Okay, okay. We will go on a date with the two of them. Ugh, oh, poor June. This this episode's it's been rough. Okay. So we are going to go actually to Brenderton Bay. I've never really been too much in Brenderton Bay. But there are a bunch of cute little places here. Um, we could go to the park, but I think we'll go to the Salty Paws Saloon. We'll go there, they can have some drinks, they can have a little bit of fun. And yeah, I'll see you when they get there. June and Rin are here on their date. So let's have them sit together at this table. Oh man, I've never actually been to this saloon. It's really cute actually. This would be a great spot. It also, if you had the dine out pack, you could do a lot with that. Who's that over there? Donica's over there. I just love these little rustic little picnic benches. It's really adorable. So let's try and chat with her. They got some country music going on. So let's ask for reassurance and um you know let's have them you know ask about her day hopefully this day so he asked for reassurance okay well she was like yeah 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 i'll reassure you so it looks like they're having a good time that's good let's have them maybe flirt do some flirty stuff tell the date a story we can do that. Let's see. Tell a story. Tell engaging story. Who are you? Why are you? Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. We're going to use the MCC command center and kick her out. Okay, so we made, we made her leave because that was kind of weird. The fact that it's like, we're on a date. Like, we're trying to have a nice date here, okay? I just want to have a good time. Oh, this is actually outside. Okay, I didn't even notice it wasn't inside. But it's cute. Okay, so have a deep conversation. So let's have them have a deep conversation. I wish they could slow dance. I don't know if you can slow dance. Oh, it's singer-songwriter. At first I thought this was like country, but it's just singer-songwriter. Oh no. No, we're not chatting with other people. Oh no, please don't get a fight with a dude with the... With the afro. That would not be fun to get in a date with on... Not to get in a fight with while you're on a date. That would suck. So they're just like dancing and vibing to the... I love this music too. Singer-songwriter, I think, is one of my favorite genres too. Yeah, so Aiden's just like... Adrian is just like awkwardly watching them. He's like, hey! Yeah, <laughs> at least they're not... He doesn't seem like mad at him, which is good. But... Let's go have them get some drinks at the bar. We'll have him. He does have, you know, he has 15,000 15, 
No, not 15,000. 1,500 bells. So let's have them get, ooh, a Lotto Chocolata. Oh, wait, that's with coconut. Let's do, uh, let's see. Sea of, oh, that's really expensive. Dim and Gusty. <laughs> we'll just do that. We'll just get a Dim and Gusty. All right. The dude's, the dude's bored with their conversation. Okay, well, then don't be in our conversation. He's going to order the drinks. Go ahead and get drinks at the bar. So you want them to have a good time. And at least have, like, a positive date. And not have a sucky date. Because, I mean, like, he literally only has one more day of classes. And then we'll be done. And she can graduate. And it'll be great. And... Honestly, like, even with the long, he has 70, 70 days left? Okay, he has 70 days left until he becomes a adult, which to me, like, makes more sense than having, like, the regular lifespan, because school still takes the same amount of days, but your lifespan doesn't, like, get any longer, so it's better if you play, I feel like, with the university on a longer one, just because then they have more time to live, because they seem to, like, just take forever to get through school. Okay, so, what are you doing? Where are you going, June? Stop chatting with random people. Sit here. I refuse to let you get in a fight on a date. Oh, wait, complain about this? I don't know why you're... Well, you can be like, yeah, other things, it wasn't too great, you know? <laughs> Boring. You know? She was like, oh, really? You didn't like it? Oh, okay, okay. But let's, maybe, let's try... We're trying to get them flirty. So, let's do some... Compliment her appearance. You know, when you go on a date, the girl always wants to know that she looks great. That she looks nice. You know, that's... Well, I mean, anybody, too. Like, even a guy, too, also wants to be know, like, Hey, you look, you're looking snazzy. You're looking nice. So, we always have to compliment the appearance. He reached level 8 of charisma, which... I don't even know how he got this high in charisma. Oh, okay, okay. Ooh, okay. Yeah, we got flirty. Yeah. They're flirty. That's good. We need to have a deep conversation. Deep conversation. And then we'll have a kiss with her. And then our date will be over. I wonder, I think, like, maybe he will ask on this end of this date after they kiss. Like, he'll ask her to be his girlfriend. Because, you know, we've had some fails throughout the season of him with his dates. But, you know, Ren has actually been really nice and really sweet. And they've gotten along really well. So, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's ask. Oh, he cannot ask her to be her. Okay. Can they not? Can he not ask her to be his girlfriend? see romance compliment it no is she not single ask if she's single i swear she was single but they just became good friends so yes rin is single why can't you ask her to be your girlfriend okay there we go ask to be girlfriend <gasps> here we go we're doing it okay maybe because they were only friends but now they're good friends yes do it Ask her to be your girlfriend. You got this, June. June would like to be... Do you, yeah, sure, let's give this a try. Okay. Aww. Aww, they're so cute. Okay, they did it. June has a girlfriend. Aww. You know, they took it slow. And I think that's always great. You know, just take it slow. Don't rush it. Being friends first, and then, you know, start a relationship. I think that's always best. That's so cute. Okay, well, we are going to go ahead and fast forward to his last day of class. And then he'll be done, and he'll be ready to graduate. Okay, everyone, it is Friday. It's his final day of classes. This series has been definitely a whirlwind. He went from, like, being a nobody spellcaster to being a spellcaster that everybody hates. So, you know, hey, that's 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 something for him. Um, but he did get a girlfriend, and he is going to graduate with really good grades. He's been very diligent about his work and stuff, so that's good. Um, but yeah, we will actually see him off. His class starts in about 
two hours. So we'll actually watch him go off to class for his final class of the game, of the series. So unfortunately it looks like June had to get in one more fight before the series was over. He's fighting in the bathroom with actually the person who is his roommate, Nicole, I think. I'm pretty sure this is her bed over here. Yeah, that's that that was anyway. Yep, so they are they're real they're real mad, but I've been taking June to the gym a lot, so he has been very um prepared for the fights. <laughs> because, you know, if people are just gonna randomly start fights with him, I don't want him to lose. Okay, stop talking to her. Man, poor June. Like, this is just... He got cursed. So, yeah, I mean, it happens. You know, not everything's gonna go your way. But he has about an hour until his class starts. So, at least he can be finally done with this. And then go and live his life outside of school. <laughs> oh, the final exam is in an hour. Oh, and we'll watch him go off to class. We'll watch him walk down the stairs one last time. Let me just lock on him. Yeah. Let's just watch him go off to class one last time. Ah, uh, man, this is like a really... That's a lot of stairs to have to walk. My college had a lot of stairs too. Ah. Uh, but he's getting to class. He's actually trying to get to class early because, you know, that's the kind of student he was. If anything, he was a very studious person. Who really enjoyed class and really enjoyed going to school so literally it's like nine o'clock and now he's just sitting here for like 30 more minutes till this class even starts okay june just finished his last class ever of college i'm sure he's very excited i think everyone gets very excited when they finish college but anyway we will come back and watch his graduation ceremony which happens tomorrow so i'll see you when we're at the graduation ceremony Okay, so June's report card came in, and he finished with all A pluses, but then his overall GPA was an A, so congratulations to him. He did it all while trying to be a spellcaster and having a girlfriend for the first time, so good for him. I'm really excited, but anyway, I'll see you when we have this graduation ceremony. Okay, so it's about an hour till June's graduation ceremony. He's just sitting here right now molding a piece of clay that was randomly found laying around. So, but anyway, I think that... Okay, so it is about an hour till June's graduation ceremony. Right now he's just kind of molding a piece of clay that he found. Um, just randomly laying around so we'll see what he ends up making with it but I don't know if we can like really invite anybody to come with us to the ceremony because it just says like like his only his household or whatever so we'll see he might just have to go alone but we do want to get a picture of him in his cap and gown you know because that's what you want you know you want to walk across that stage and be like yeah I did it I did it and I completed it and it was a lot of hard work. Actually, it really was. Like, June did not honestly do much other than school in this game. He did not. <laughs> he was, he was, I guess, a pretty just boring, plain guy. But, you know, sometimes that's okay. That's okay. It's okay to be boring. It's okay just to be happy. We're going to actually start a cheer. We should start a cheer. Let's start the cheer. Yeah, you. We made it. We made it. Looks like nobody's joining in on the cheer, but you know. That's okay. That's okay. We don't always need need a cheer. Need people to join in on the cheer. But at least, you know, he's made some more enemies too. Like Trisha over here. They started fighting and I, I'm not really sure why, but you're gonna how do you turn the volume change the volume to low? I was like, how do you Oh, they're doing the cheer together. Oh, that's so cute. Okay, even though Trisha hates him, they still have school spirit together. And that's the most important part, is caring about your school. And, you know, even if you don't like the person, you'll still care about your own school. So see, they're like against Brychester. All about Foxbury. Foxbury, Foxbury, woo! Okay, here is June in his little 
<gasps> cap and gown. Oh, it looks so cute. We gotta get pictures. We must take pictures. We have to be that mom that like takes all the pictures, you know? Oh, we're so proud of him. Ah, oh, he did it. And he graduated with all A's. So I call that a success. So anyway, thank you all so much for watching this Let's Play. I know that it was kind of, you know, take, took a while to get out and stuff. But I really appreciate it. And I hope you enjoyed watching June go through college. Um, and hopefully this maybe shows you what university is about. So if you want to get the game for yourself, you know, you can get it and enjoy it. Um, but yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And of course, hit that notification bell to know when we release new videos. See y'all next time. Bye!